this is gonna be my finger. I hurt my finger, so if you guys are wondering, and that's kind of distracting, but I'm sorry for that. Um, but anyways, welcome to today's video. So for today's video, it is going to be a skincare routine. Um, this video is going to be pretty short, I think, because I only use a few things. I'm going to show you guys what I use, so if you guys want to use some of the products, and a lot of you guys have probably already saw from my previous videos, on like what I use but also thank you guys so much for almost 15 subscribers I'm not there yet but I'm one subscriber away so please subscribe to my YouTube channel and also like this video and turn on those post notifications so you get notified when I upload a video I'm super excited to hit 15 subscribers I know it's not a lot but it is to me um, but yeah let's just get right on to my skincare routine okay guys so um the first thing I do is a face mask and I don't do this like every day because you're not probably supposed to do that you, you can do it like two to three times a week so this is I use this one you guys have saw it in like my pamper slash glow up I really love it it's like a fun face mask so I'm going to apply this it also comes with this is very um, really good that it comes with like one of these because I, it's not sanitary like as sanitary as when you use your hands because the, the germs on your hands obviously and also with the virus going around I just dropped the lid um, but anyways now I just take this and it's really bubbly because sometimes all the air bubbles but then I will just uh, and basically you guys are probably wondering why I'm in a dress but that's went to the store and I was I did take a shower but I am applying this before or after <laughs> But yeah, you guys are probably like, why is she wearing a dress? Um, and it's around like, I'm pretty sure it's like eight. I'm doing this video when I usually do my skincare. Um, but yeah, now I will just apply this. And I really love it. I feel like it's like a really a fun face mask. If you're like at a sleepover, well, Corona, but like um, when, if you like ever, I don't know, if you're like hanging out with someone and you wanna do something fun, do this face mask, like it's really fun. And this video is not sponsored. I really love this face mask though, so yeah. Um, but anyways, I finish, after I finish applying this, I have one, two, three, three more, um, three more things I will add to my face. Three more skincare products, basically, and they're really good. A lot of them are, um, a lot of them are just like normal things that a lot of people probably use. But I just wanted to share this because if you guys don't know what to put on your face, these things are really useful. So by the way, you guys, no one needs to wear skincare. Well, it's good for your face, and that's mainly why I do it, and also just because fun in a way it's like sometimes it can be fun but um i put this now i will just put this away in my drawer and now i will wait like usually around five to ten minutes because it, this gets really foamy so after this dries i will get back to you guys so as you can probably tell um the face mask is pretty much like complete and it's ready to be taken off so now i will just use this blush cloth any wash cloth basically and I will put add like a tiny bit of water and then kind of rub it off sometimes it takes me two just because it's like oh, there's like a lot on there but then if the first side is like already dirty I will just flip it over and use the other side that's how I that's the first thing I do um but yeah it's not anything fancy or anything like that it's just it's really it's sometimes fun to do and it's really nice sometimes to just have a night where you do a face mask and i my favorite type of face mask personally is a peel off because i don't know how i don't know like how effective they are but they make my skin really soft all face masks I, um they're just really satisfying and yeah i just really love peel offs but i love all of masks like clay masks and stuff like that so i'm going to probably this usually takes me like around um 
it usually takes me like five minutes to take off which is not that long but I'm going to finish taking this off because I don't want to, you guys to be bored but then I'm going to do the rest of my skincare stuff okay guys so the next thing I use for my skincare is this witch hazel toner which I'm almost um it is like my mom's and she told me to use it and it works really well but you can I think you can buy any witch hazel toner and it works but I have the lemon scent and I will usually have these little pads but I do not have any right now so I have like this piece of paper towel and I'll just fold it so it's small and then I will just squirt I will not squirt that much because I don't want my face to be like really wet but I will just have like a little and then I'll just kind of rub I'm pretty sure actually I do have some of those pads um, but they're in my mom's room and I'm in my bathroom, so I will not, I'm not going to go get them now, but, um, that is my toner, so it will usually take me, like, a few seconds to just rub it around my face, and then I'll just let it, like, kind of sit, and then the next thing I do, I do moisturizer so i use this garnier skin active and you can also use this as a day slash night mask but i personally just like using it for moisturizer but maybe one day i will try using it as a mask and then i will just anyways rub my one rub all of the moisturizer in and i don't put that much on but I feel like it makes my skin kind of soft and then sometimes I will just add some to my neck because it's good for your neck too and then the two last things that I do for my skincare are oil and eye cream so for the oil I use this serum is clinical pro heal serum and a lot of the stuff is for my mom since i don't need skincare as much but she has some so i just had this oil and i will not put a lot because then it makes my face really oily so i'll just put like a tiny square on each of my like parts of my face and then so on my nose over here and then obviously i'll just rub it in and sometimes, like I said, if I add too much, it gets, like, my skin oily, like, right here. You can probably see how oily and shiny it is. So, I, like, try not to add too much. Sometimes I add a little too much, and then sometimes I add too much less. So, sometimes I have to put, like, a square more. So, that is one of the last things on my skincare list. And as you can probably tell, my skin is shiny. But, it... I feel like it works and it does fine. The last thing I use is Rodin Plus Fields Active Hydration Bright Eye Complex. And I was looking this up from Amazon to add to my description box for a link. And it was $90. So obviously my mom got this a long time ago. It lost the cap. So if you are want to buy if you want to buy an expensive skincare product, I suggest you um think you like feel like you're gonna use it a lot because if you don't it's gonna be a waste of money oh my gosh i added way too much um but yeah anyways the last thing i do is add like um a squirt of that eye complex cream and just rub it in and i try to go pretty soft so i don't like hurt and go like that really fastly but yeah so that's all the stuff I do for my skincare routine. This video was short, like I say for like a lot of my videos, but I wanted to share some of my favorite products that I use and just like what I use. And um, also I totally forgot in the daytime, I do wash my face with this cleanser. Um, and if you wanna buy any of these products, I will not link them in this video because I already have them linked in another video. All of the products I use um, will be in that video. If not, just find a good toner and um, just try to find the stuff. So, but yeah, I also use this time, this stuff in the daytime. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications because you guys know we're almost to 15 subscribers and I'm And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and.